Fruit for his practice. Extension on the sun. Folks, we have Sam Hubbard as well. <laughs> All right, well, how was it out there? <laughs> how was it out there? Oh, it was, it was cool. Uh, just going through what we've been doing during the summertime. So it was just good to put, finally put some equipment on a little bit and just run around. You had to get up to 40. 440. 440. 440. Is that alarm went off? You was in mid drink, 440. And? You feel like, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. It was, no, it was okay, though. I went to bed kind of early and, uh, we just woke up at 440, got in here, and we had fun for the first day. I <laughs> <laughs> almost. Any other team, you could clearly start clearly well with at least four guys mm -hmm. who are going to rotate. How do you feel about that? What's it like to be part of that rotation but not do that? Have you ever heard of deductive reasoning? I have. So, if, you know, Sam and Taekwon starters, they share time with me, would have been me. Yeah, so, no, nah, it's cool though. Uh, no, nah, I mean, as long as I can contribute and, and help the team win, it's, it's all good. So, I feel like all the accolades, all that stuff will come with it, just me going hard as I can, just being the best team. Well, how much does that add to your competitive fire, knowing that you have to keep up with that? And also, you don't want to be outshined by the uh, I mean, it helps every day. And then I got, you know, Taquan, Sam, and Nick, they help push me every day too, so. You got good teammates like that. It's not. It's not far as it is. What do you learn from the way last year ended? How does that change the approach at all? Just knowing that hey, you guys had a great season last year, but it didn't end the way you wanted. Did it change anything going into camp? Uh, I mean, we didn't like how it finished last season, but uh, I feel like we got the guys to, you know, redeem ourselves and go harder. So we, we know what it takes. And uh, we just got to keep pushing forward to get our ultimate goal. How beneficial will be this course of the season aware and tear that you have that many guys rotating through the line and kind of they preserve your bodies a little bit? Yeah, I never thought about it that way until like a couple days ago driving and going. But uh, you you got those guys rotating in like that, so we we really gonna get that wear and tear that another DN probably wear another school. So it's really beneficial for us and our future, you know, at the college football. They've done away uh, with two a days, mm. but you guys are starting a week earlier. Does do you care either way? Uh, or I mean, two days is always, you know, real tough. But uh, starting earlier, like today, you know, it wasn't a bad practice. You know, just working on the fundamentals and you know, just getting back in the rhythm of things. So starting earlier, that's that's kind of beneficial in, in my opinion. Is there, is there, you remember what it's like to be a true freshman mm -hmm. and how overwhelming it can be at times. Is there somebody uh, either in your position group or anybody on the football team that you have looked at who's coming in new this year who is immediately impressed with what they've uh, been able to do? Chase, Chase Young. Uh, you know, first today, you know, it's the first day with no pass, but he showed good flashes of pass rushing. Uh, high school. He, like all the young D linemen today impressed me. You know, they, they kind of was up to speed and everything. You know, they didn't look lost. They looked like they were going up to speed. Everything was going. To, to the point about the difference in camp this year, I've seen it two a days, but it's long. Um, is as somebody who's been through a lot of these, is there any you know curiosity about making sure guys are fresh in week four and week five? I mean, yeah, as best you can be. I know. Like like she just said, we got more rotation, so. Even though it's longer, we're still getting we're less plays because we're rotating so much. So uh, with the rotation that we got and the depth that we got throughout the whole defense, it take less pressure off our game. Does the mentality change at all, knowing that you start with a conference game? That there's you know, not a couple non-conference to get in? I mean, not non-conference or not. I mean, I feel like we still have the same mentality, but, you know, any young is a great team, and we gotta we got to bring our A game, especially going there. They always give us, you know, their best fight every year. So. It kind of does, but in a way it doesn't. Has been the chase edge 